If you want to make over $100,000 a year passive income, you need to know that 43% of all Amazon sellers make over $100,000 every single year. And right now, I'm going to show you how you can start your own Amazon business in just five easy steps. And you need to understand the pros and the cons before you start selling on Amazon, because if you don't understand the cons and how to avoid some of the massive mistakes that people make, you could end up losing thousands of dollars. And the first pro with selling on Amazon is that a lot of people have made hundreds of thousands, even millions of dollars selling on Amazon. And if you're new to the channel, my name is Travis. I've done over $6 million selling on Amazon and I've helped people like Juliana make over $100,000 in just her first six months selling this sports bra or Mina who's done over a million dollars with his electrolyte powders even though he only started with $1,500 and AJ actually started his Amazon business with zero dollars and now he's done over a million dollars and there have been a ton of other people just like them and I've taught all these people my exact step-by-step -step formula for selling on Amazon. And that's exactly what I'm gonna share with you in this video. So make sure to smash the like button because I've been selling on Amazon for over eight years and I'm gonna condense down everything I've learned into this one video. And the reason that selling on Amazon is such a big opportunity is the second pro, which is Amazon is huge. They're a 1.6 trillion dollar company. That's not a million dollar company. That's not a billion dollar company. 1.6 trillion dollar company. Last year they did over 600 billion dollars in sales on their website. And a lot of people don't realize this, but most of the sales, in fact, two thirds of all the sales that happen on Amazon are from people like you and me selling our products on Amazon. Amazon doesn't sell most of the products that are being sold on amazon.com. They rely on people like you and me to sell those products. So if you're looking to make six figures passive income, selling on Amazon is a pretty huge opportunity. But there is a big con with selling on Amazon and that's that you need to do the work. This is not a get rich quick scheme. You're not gonna become a millionaire overnight, despite what all the gurus and all these people online are telling you. And most people make a huge mistake when selling on Amazon. And I'm gonna talk about the top three mistakes that new Amazon sellers make in this video. And the first mistake is they try to do it by themselves. And I do have an Amazon FBA program. There's a link to that down in the description if you do want more one-on-one -on -one help. However, I also have a free Amazon FBA course that I'm gonna be giving to you at the end of this video. It's an eight hour course, it's completely free. I do recommend that you watch this video all the way through first so you have an understanding of the pros and the cons of Amazon. And selling on Amazon is actually pretty easy if you understand how to do it. Now we are gonna talk about some more cons later in this video but let me show you this really cool product that i found on amazon and this product is making over three hundred and sixty thousand dollars every single month on amazon that's more money than most people make in a year and this product is making that much money every single month and i found this product by going to amazon.com clicking on the best sellers clicking on sports and outdoors. And then I found this product here. It's a resistance loop exercise band. And here's the secret. You can actually find out how much any product on Amazon is making. All you have to do is scroll down to the best selling rank number, copy that, paste that in the Jungle Scout sales estimator tool. We're then gonna select the country, in this case it's the United States, as well as the category, and paste in that rank number. And we can see that's how many units it's selling every month. If we multiply that by the cost of the product, we can see that this product is doing over $360,000 in sales every month. This seller is probably having to pay the 15% Amazon selling fee, as well as the Amazon FBA pick and pack fee, and they also have to pay for their product costs and probably some other things, but even still, they're doing over $100,000 in profit every single month. And I'm gonna show you how to find your own product just like this one. Now, I can't promise you'll be making $100,000 profit every month, but our goal in this video is to help you find a product that'll make you $100,000 profit at least every year. And once you know how to do that, you can find a second, third, fourth, fifth product. And before you know it, you can be making a million dollars plus profit a year if that is what your goal is. In fact, one of my students, Brent, launched this product. He's done over $2 million in sales. Last year alone, he did over a million dollars in sales. And what's crazy about his story is he did that while working a full-time job as a first responder helicopter pilot and raising two beautiful kids. So if he can do it and all these people can do it, you can do it too. You just need to have the right step-by-step -step formula. And I'm gonna show you exactly what that formula is in just a minute, but there is one more pro that we forgot to talk about, and that is the Amazon FBA program. And for those of you that don't know, FBA stands for Fulfilled by Amazon. This is the magical part about selling on Amazon. This is what makes it passive income. Because if you use the FBA program, you can travel the world, you can live wherever you want, and your business will keep running because the way that FBA works is you send the products that you wanna sell on Amazon's website 
into the Amazon warehouse. And when someone goes to Amazon's website, clicks to buy your product and you get a sale, you don't need to ship it out yourself. Amazon is gonna ship that product out for you. And when you use the FBA program, it makes your product Prime eligible, meaning that Prime customers can buy your product and receive it within two days or less. And there are over 300 million Prime customers in the world. In the United States alone, there's over a hundred million Prime customers, meaning close to 50% of all households have a Prime account. And people that have a Prime account are likely to buy Prime products on Amazon. So let me show you how to do this and it's easy to get started. All you have to do is go to sell.amazon.com to sign up for your seller account. Now warning, there are two different types of accounts you can sign up for. You can sign up for either the individual account or the professional account. And the individual account is free but you will have to pay an additional fee of 99 cents for every item you sell. The professional account will cost you $39.99 a month, but you can sell unlimited products without any extra fees. So if you're looking to sell more than 40 units a month, I'd recommend signing up for the professional plan. And to do that, you would click the sign up button here. However, if you do wanna save some money and sign up for a free Amazon account, you have to scroll all the way to the bottom and Amazon actually hides this. They don't want too many people knowing about this. And if you click right here, sign up as an individual seller, you can save that $39.99 a month. But again, if you're looking to make six figures passive income, sign up for the professional plan. It's gonna be worth it in the long run. The next step to selling on Amazon is to figure out what product you should sell on Amazon's website. And there is a tool that makes it so easy to find products to sell on Amazon. It's called Helium 10. And I actually have the hookup with Helium 10. There's a link down below in the description. You can use that link and sign up for a free account. Now, the free account does have limited features. And if you are looking to unlock all the features, I do have the hookup. I have a discount code. When you click on the link down below, that's gonna save you a ton of money. It's the best deal you can find on this tool. Just click that link in the description. But once you've signed up for this tool, you're gonna log in and you're gonna use this magnet tool right here to find a product. And I'm gonna show you how I found a product using this tool that has the potential to make me $100,000 a year. But before I do that, I have to tell you about one of the biggest cons with Amazon FBA. And one of the reasons why I see so many people failing with Amazon, and that's because most people are doing it wrong. There's actually four different ways to sell on Amazon. The first is where you find products that are being sold at a discount, like this air fryer toaster oven that's being sold on walmart.com for $119.89. But this exact same product is being sold on amazon.com for over $500. And all you have to do is buy this product from walmart.com for the discounted price of $119 flip it on Amazon for that inflated price of $500 and you can keep all the profit. And this is called retail arbitrage. And this works really well because so many people like myself shop almost exclusively on Amazon. I never go to walmart.com. Most of the people watching this video never go to walmart.com, but sometimes Walmart has better deals. So you can take advantage of this and you can buy products at a discounted price and flip them on Amazon. Now this isn't my favorite way to sell on Amazon and it's not passive income because you're constantly gonna need to be searching for new products to sell and other people can buy and sell the same products as you so you don't really have any kind of a competitive edge. The second way to sell on Amazon is called wholesale and you can go to sites like globalsources.com where you can buy products with a wholesale discount and then flip it on Amazon for the full retail price. Like this bedside lamp slash alarm clock that's being sold on Global Sources for $18.90. And this exact same product is being sold on Amazon for $46.98. And the difference with wholesale and retail arbitrage is with retail arbitrage, you can just buy one product if you want. With wholesale, you are gonna have to buy the product in bulk but because you're doing that, it's a little bit more reliable and you're able to buy the same product again and again. But I still don't recommend this way for selling on Amazon because there's nothing stopping other people from coming, buying the exact same product as you with that same wholesale discount, flipping that product on Amazon and to stay competitive, they might even lower the price. And what happens is they'll lower the price, which means you have to lower your price. And before you know it, nobody's making a profit. The third type of product that you can sell on Amazon is a product like this silicone kitchen mitt. And this mitt right here is doing over $1.2 million in sales every single month. And as I mentioned, you can find out how much any product on Amazon is doing. We go to the best selling rank number, we copy that, paste it in the tool. And we can see that this product is selling over 40,000 units per month. Multiply that by the cost of the product and boom, we see that this product's doing $1.2 million in sales. But what's even crazier about this is this exact same product is being sold on Alibaba.com for just $2.40 a piece. 
even though on Amazon it's being sold for over $30. And this way of selling on Amazon is called private label. And it's where you take a generic product, you slap your brand on it, you put your own private label on that product and you sell it on Amazon. And this seems like a really easy way to make money on Amazon. And it used to be the best way to make money on Amazon, but it doesn't really work so well anymore because if it's easy for you to find a product on Alibaba and just slap your brand on it, it's easy for everyone else to do the same thing. And so I personally don't recommend the first three ways of selling on Amazon. I wanna be clear, you can make money with all these methods, but usually it's just a matter of time until someone comes along and steals your product and you're left without any sales. But there's actually a fourth way to sell on Amazon that's my personal favorite way. It's what I do and it's what I recommend to all my students. I call it creating a passion product. And this is similar to private label, but the big difference is I don't recommend you just go to Alibaba, take a generic product and slap your brand on it. I recommend that you try to find a way to improve the product. And that's what I did with my first passion product. And this product did over a million dollars in sales within just two months of launching this product on Amazon. I was making over $30,000 a month in revenue, over $10,000 profit. In my first year, I did over a hundred thousand dollars in profit. And I'm gonna show you right now how you can use this method and how I just used it again to find a new product that I just launched on Amazon, a product that has the potential to make over a hundred thousand dollars profit. And the key secret to making money on Amazon is to understand that Amazon is just a search engine. People go to Amazon to search for products that they want to buy. And if you understand this concept, you can game the system, you can hack the system. Because what you can do using this tool called Helium 10 is you can find out what people are searching for on Amazon. And if you know what people are searching for on Amazon, you can create the perfect product for them, sell it to them and make a ton of money. And here's how you can find your own six figure Amazon product. So we're gonna log into Helium 10 and we're gonna click on the magnet tool. And this is my favorite tool for quickly finding new products to sell on Amazon. A couple months ago, I was interested in the carnivore diet. So I typed in carnivore diet into this magnet tool search bar and it showed me that over 9,000 people per month are searching carnivore diet on Amazon, which means a lot of people are going to Amazon and they're looking to buy carnivore diet related products. But what makes this tool so powerful is if you scroll down to the bottom, it'll show you a list of other things that people are searching for in Amazon that are related to carnivore diet. And this is where the gold is. We want to find something that a lot of people are searching for in Amazon. But when we go to Amazon and we search for that, there's no products that really fit that description. So what you're gonna do here is you're gonna click on the magnet IQ column. And this will sort the list so that the best ideas are at the top. But keep in mind, Helium 10 doesn't always know what the best ideas are. So you're gonna to wanna to go through these one by one and try to find something that a lot of people are searching for. But when you go to Amazon and you search for it, there's no products that exist. And I recommend going through these one by one. And on the third page, I found this, carnivore electrolytes. And we can see that over a thousand people per month are searching for exactly carnivore electrolytes. But when we go to Amazon and we search for that, there's a lot of different electrolyte powders, but none of them are for the carnivore diet. Meaning that if we created a product that was perfect for the carnivore diet, put it on Amazon, a lot of people would rather buy our product than the competitors. And that's the key. We're not just making a generic electrolyte powder. We're finding a niche and we're filling the niche. And we're actually trying to improve our product so that it's perfect for these specific people. And keep in mind, there are a lot of ways that you can improve a product. Sometimes just by having really high quality branding, that's enough to stand out from the competition. But I recommend whenever you can to niche down because the riches are in the niches. People don't wanna buy a generic product. They want to buy something that's perfect for them. And after you have your product idea, it's time to get it manufactured. And you can go to sites like alibaba.com or thomasnet.com to find manufacturers. If you're looking to get your product manufactured overseas, I'd recommend alibaba.com. Now, here's the key thing. Most people go to alibaba.com, they look for products and all they do is take that exact same product and slap their brand on it. What you can do instead is message the suppliers and ask them if they can customize the product. This will make it so that no one will be copying your product because it's not just a generic product, it's your own custom product. And the way to use alibaba.com is type in what kind of a product you're looking to get manufactured. You're then gonna click on manufacturers and hit search. And you'll get a list of different manufacturers and you're gonna click on these one by one 
And what you're looking for is a manufacturer that's been around for a number of years and has an overall good rating. You're then gonna message them, describe the kind of product that you're looking to create and ask them what the MOQ is. MOQ stands for minimum order quantity. And that's how many of those units at a minimum you're going to have to order so that they will actually produce your product. Because if you say, hey, I want 10, they're not gonna work with you. It's probably usually a minimum of around 300 units, which actually isn't that many units when you're trying to start a real business. You probably want more than 300. But if you're looking to just test out whether or not your product will work, 300 units isn't bad. If you are looking to get something manufactured in the United States, you can go to thomasnet.com, type in what you're looking to get manufactured, and you'll get a list of manufacturers that can do that exact thing for you. And once your product's manufactured, you can ask your manufacturer to ship the product into the United States, into an Amazon warehouse. Now I go into a lot more detail about this in my free eight hour Amazon FBA course that I'm gonna to give to you guys in just a few minutes at the end of this video. But right now there's a couple more steps that I want you to understand before you watch that video so you can understand the whole process of what it's like to sell on Amazon. Because here's the other way that you can hack Amazon that you can make a ton of money. Again, as I mentioned, Amazon's a search engine. People go to Amazon to search for things that they wanna buy. And your goal is to get your product to the top of the search results. And there are some secret ways that a lot of people don't know about that you can hack the algorithm so that your product gets to the top. And one of the best ways to do that is by creating the perfect listing for your Amazon product. And when you're adding a product onto Amazon, which is the next step for selling on Amazon, here's some things that you're gonna wanna consider. And one of the biggest things you're gonna wanna be thinking about is what are people typing into Amazon to search for your product? These are called keywords. And if you know what your search phrases, what your keywords are that people are gonna use to find your product, you can hack the system so that Amazon will put you to the top of the search results. And the best way to do that is to add these keywords into your title and into your bullet points as you're creating your product listing. You're also gonna to wanna to create a main image that stands out from the competition. Because when people go to Amazon, if all the other products look the same and yours pops, people are more likely to click and buy your product. For instance, since we're selling a carnivore electrolyte powder, we created the title Carnivore Electrolytes, Premium Hydration Powder for Carnivore Diet, Balanced Electrolyte Support, Zero Carb, Keto Friendly, Optimal Energy and Recovery. Because I know people are searching for carnivore electrolytes as well as hydration powder, carnivore diet, and things like zero carb and keto friendly. There's a bunch more tips about how to do this that I'll talk about in that eight hour course. But the fifth step when selling on Amazon, and this is the exciting part, this is when you get to celebrate, is to finally launching your product. On the day that you launch your product, your goal is to get as many sales from day one as possible. Because when you get a ton of sales, Amazon's gonna see that you have a great product. It's gonna put your product higher up in the search results, which leads to more sales. And this creates a snowball effect where you're gonna go higher and higher in the search results and it's ultimately gonna mean more money for you. And the way to do this is to start marketing your product before you ever launch it so that when you launch it, you have a bunch of followers, a bunch of raving fans that are gonna buy your product from day one. This is what we did with Carnivore Electrolytes and we did hundreds of dollars in sales just on our first day. Now, before you watch that free eight hour Amazon FBA course, let's talk about a few more of the cons with selling on Amazon. And the second con with Amazon is that you do need to play by Amazon's rules. They have a bunch of weird rules and restrictions. And if you're not careful, you could get in trouble. And that's the second mistake that most beginner sellers make is they don't have a launch strategy. This is something I talk about in depth in my Amazon FBA program. And that's why I recommend watching that entire free eight hour Amazon FBA course I have. I've been through this. I've been selling online for over 10 years on Amazon for over eight years. I've made a bunch of mistakes. I've seen all the little weird things that could happen. So I recommend you learn from my mistakes. And as I mentioned, I've taught thousands of people how to do this and I've seen all the mistakes that they make and I've compiled all those mistakes and all those learnings into this free free eight hour Amazon FBA course. Obviously, if you want more detailed help, I do have an Amazon FBA program that comes with weekly Q&A calls. It gets you access to a private Facebook mastermind and it has a bunch more content that I don't share here on YouTube. Because honestly, I share a lot of things in my program that I do when selling on Amazon that I don't want everyone on the internet to know. Even though I do share a ton of my best stuff for free here on YouTube. And the third biggest con and biggest mistake that I see so many sellers making is that Amazon is growing every single day. And there's 9 million sellers, 4,000 new sellers joining every single day. And every second that you're waiting, there's someone else that's getting rich on Amazon instead of you. And the mistake that people make is they get stuck in analysis paralysis. They see this opportunity and they don't act because they're afraid. And I was afraid when I first thought about selling on Amazon. I didn't wanna spend money starting a business. What if I failed? 
But here's the truth. I had the idea for starting my first passion product business a year before I ever started working on it. And that business went on to make me $10,000 every single month. If I would have started my business a year earlier, I would have made an extra $120,000. So I ended up losing out on $120,000 because I was afraid of spending and risking a few thousand dollars. The thing about selling on Amazon is it doesn't matter if you fail. If you fail and you learn from your mistakes and you launch another product, you will eventually have success. You will eventually be a six figure, seven figure seller. And right now I'm gonna give you a free eight hour step-by-step -step Amazon FBA course. This is an A to Z course. It's so much value. I put 10 years worth of experience into this one video. So click on that video, get that free video. I'll see you in the next video. And thanks for watching.